time to answer that particular order for you guys, okay? Um, I asked him if he thinks he said he could compete. He told me that's the best answer by me. Yeah, I think he said he could compete. Because I'm going to tell you this flat out. It's only missing symbols. He's working on that. That was another question I asked. Was he going to work on this thing, on, on his symbol uh, add-on? He said, yeah, but first of all, they wanted to get the main problem out of the way was these sets not functioning the way that it should function. So he's done that. So give him some time. He need to answer all these orders first, and then he'll go back and he'll try this. But when Ion comes out and Mad Cats come out, why do I need to go spend money with them to buy this to buy another set? I have a perfectly good set sitting in my house from Goodwood Mods. So I think that they can compete. I think at the price point, they're really competing. And I don't think he can go wrong with that. Okay. Uh, the biggest one, another big one was, was he going to be able to ship internationally to all my international friends in the UK and beyond? And he said that they're working on finding a reasonable shipping method for the international customers. They're going to do their best to take care of their foreign rockers. So people in the UK, you know, people in Asia, wherever you guys are from, listen to what I'm saying. He's going to take care of you guys. So you guys should have no fear in ordering this kit if you guys are overseas because he's going to take care of you. For those who don't know the history of Google Mods, really quick, I know some of you, but in case you don't know who I am or you never see me, uh, as you know, I'm Cena Game 54. I've done these reviews for a little about three months now. Google Mods is a company that I first reviewed for their struts. Rich and Paul has always been very professional. They've taken care of all of my viewers, all of my readers, and all of their customers. A couple of my problems with their struts, they answered it. So if they're going to be that good with you guys on a $16.95 item, you better bet your bottom dollar they're going to be just as good, if not better, with this drum kit. All right, now let's talk about prices. I brought that up. Everybody asks why I don't talk about prices in the beginning, because I'm going to tell you why. Prices are a deterrent. There's other things I need to get out for myself and for you and for the company I'm representing before I throw a price tag at you. As a consumer, if somebody walked up to me and said, man, look, this is an awesome product. I just sat in my house and played it for six hours, but I want 400 bucks. I'm going to say, it might be good, but 400 bucks is a little bit too much. I don't even have any information. So that's why I don't drop a price right at the beginning of my review. Price for this set, $219. That is $199 plus 30 bucks for shipping and handling. $219. Now, let's do a little bit talking about that because... I know there's a lot of people out there already. Gosh darn it, gosh darn it, David Sheck, I think Clee, and a few other people that's already said they're ready to drop money right now on this particular set buying this review. Okay? Give me one second. 